What's up guys, this is Jay and today I'm going to be uh, teaching you how to quickly white balance your footage using DaVinci Resolve and some gray cards, alright? So uh, let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you want to do is load up your footage. So go ahead and click that. Go ahead and go to your color tab. Change your um, your footage, decode it to show for raw. So go ahead and click decode using clip color space BMD film so now you should have a um, raw footage uh, the next thing you're gonna do is find that reference shot of your gray card or whatever you're using I say that looks pretty good okay and the next thing you're gonna do is click on this window qualifier click on the cir circle mask go ahead and drag that over to your um, gray, gray card reference Press Shift H. That should um, isolate just that gray area. All right. The next thing you're gonna do is um, uh, turn turn down the exposure a little bit. It should be in the middle because it's the gray area. So just turn it down like that. That's pretty good. And then the next thing you're gonna do, and uh, if you don't know how to turn your scopes on, just go to View, Video Scopes, turn it on. Uh, the next thing you're gonna do is go to your vector scope and basically what you want to do is this white blob and you can zoom in by pressing alt scrolling in with your mouse uh, what you want to do is get this blob to line up in that crosshair right here in the vector scope so we're gonna do that by moving your color temperature and me and by moving your tint so let's go ahead and start moving things here move to the right That looks pretty good. Didn't even have to. Okay. Didn't have to move my color temperature that much. So my white balance was pretty good already. So I'll zoom out and see if that looks good. Mm. Let's move it up just a tiny bit. Move it to the right. Okay. So let's go ahead and click on the parade and see how that looks. Uh, that looks pretty good. I mean... You're not going to get a perfect result. You obviously have to tweak it a little bit more, but that looks way better. Better than what we had it earlier. So let's go ahead and remove that isolation. Shift H. Remove that mask. And there's your white balance footage. And then you just can just continue with your grid after that. Hopefully uh, that taught you something. I know it's quick, but I uh, don't want to take forever. So if you have any questions, let me know. Peace.